Welcome to this video on column stats in Google Sheets. So if you use Google Sheets like me to collate some data, you might want to figure out, you might want to have a look at some of the information that's going on in your columns. Now you may have a lot more data than me. This is just a really nice example. But if you've got a massive spreadsheet with loads of data down the column and you just want to do a quick analysis of that one column, there's a really nice little function that you can use. So if you click on that column and click on the little arrow at the top, on the drop down towards the bottom, you'll see column stats. Now that's just going to pop up at the right hand side. And then you can see I've got a table there showing me how often those numbers appear, those order amounts. And I can scroll down and I can have a look at other information as well which is quite useful. I can see unique values, I can see the sum, the average, the median, the min and the max. So loads of different functions that you might enter manually. You can see all of that information just by looking at column stats, which is super, super useful, uh, really, really useful to do. What you can also do is use the arrows at the top to click through to your different columns. So you, again, you can see all of that information some of them might not be super helpful but if i look at order dates that you can see there's some differences on there and again just scroll down and you can see extra bits of information going on about the info in that column only so the only one on this spreadsheet that's going to give me any real data is the order amount but i can flick through depending on what type of data what type of spreadsheet i'm looking at so remember that was clicking on that drop down on the column. Let me go to another one. I'm going to column stats towards the bottom. And then you can see all of that super useful information. You don't have to do those functions. You can see all of it as you scroll down. Do not forget to scroll down and get that extra juicy bit of de information at the bottom. And see what you can use. See what information you can find out about the data that you are looking at using column stats. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.